Rajni, as I call him, is a boy that is full of life, full of smiles and now full of hope. You see, my son has a blood condition called thalassemia. Thalassemia is a general name for a blood disease that involves abnormalities in the hemoglobin, the oxygen-carrying part of the red blood cells. Hemoglobin is mainly made up of two types of protein called alpha and beta globin. A boy like Raja does not produce enough one or sometimes both proteins. As a result, the red blood cells may be abnormal and unable to carry enough oxygen throughout the body. Thalassemia is one of the most common genetic disorders worldwide. More than 100,000 babies are born with thalassemia. Rajni was one of those babies. He receives free treatment from Calcutta Mercy Hospital as a result of donors like you supporting the hospital's effort to help the children and the poor in India. He has been coming to the hospital monthly for his blood transfusions. I'm so thankful for this free treatment. Calcutta Mercy Ministries has provided something that we were unable to provide for ourselves. Recently, Rajni started having very sharp pains in his upper left side of his belly. Dr. Ghosh, a doctor at Calcutta Mercy Hospital, checked him out and informed me that Rajni needed a splenectomy. This was very frightening to me. My child, he's already been treated for thalassemia and now is having a major surgery? We had a very long day yesterday. We left our home and came to the hospital. We traveled by train many hours to get there. Trips like these are very long. Once we arrived, he will be placed on three specific vaccines, which will take three weeks to be effective. Following that, he will have a sonogram of his abdomen to rule out any pathology in liver and kidney. Altogether, it will take a month at least to prepare Rajni for this operation. Meanwhile, they have to collect extra blood for this operation. This has proven difficult as Rajni has blood type A negative and it is harder blood type to come by in India. We are at present conducting his pre-operation checkup that includes USG test to locate any stones in the system. We are also doing routine blood tests, liver function tests, just to name a few. Rajni would be staying at the hospital for 10 days as he undergoes his surgery. Besides his monthly medical care that Calcutta Mercy Ministries underwrites, the surgery will now cost another $500. We are honored that the free medical care and surgery provided to Rajni and other children like him is made possible only through the faithful monthly support by faithful partners like you. Thank you for helping Calcutta Mercy Ministries that changed the lives of my son and mine also. You are making a huge difference in Calcutta, India. Thank you so much.